Welcome back to a new video and this time we're looking at a Felmec cooker hood. But first let's go outdoors. Windy. the flapper inside the cooker hood, the pressure is making it flap. So it's got a flapper with springs, but the springs wear out. So basically they, the flaps get sucked open and then it just starts sucking air. If you put a piece of tissue under the uh, cooker hood itself, where the filter is, um, it will hold that tissue up against the uh, filter so it is sucking quite a, quite a lot of um, warm air out the kitchen so we tried different things on this but there was only real one thing that I found out about that really works on these so anyway let's have a look so we got the um, guard off there's the, like the shroud and the um, pipe I'm not sure if this is, it's a Falmec hood and I'm not sure if that's the official way that they're connected up or not, but anyway, so take that off and then we expose the flapper. If you didn't have the flapper, it, need, it does need it. You can see it's, the air is sucking it up into the tube. It's supposed to be fixed in place, but that broke a while back. So um, yeah, it's like uh, just held in place when the, um, trail things put over so yeah we take it out and we can have a have a look at what I've done and what I've done is use magnets these are these tiny little powerful ones they look like little batteries those little kind of button cell batteries but I've got the smallest ones I could get and most powerful and then on the other side what I've done is got a steel uh, washer and kind of bent it over and fixed it against the plastic and also glued that on the plastic as well and what that gives you there is the uh, washer so what that gives you is a good um, close of the flaps and like a it takes a certain amount of pressure to blow them open or suck them open so with the cooker hood blowing open fan one one flap opens and then any other speed than one both flaps open so the pressure builds up, we do a demo in a minute, the pressure builds up and it opens up. But what it doesn't allow is the wind to suck the flaps open and chatter, you know, all night. So, put it back in. here we go, this is how it works. Speed one. Pop. Just um, with the one side opening, it, it makes no real difference to the extraction, it all still works fine, no problem at all. And like I say, anything faster than one, both of the flaps will open. But you can see it working nicely. Still got a little bit of air coming in and out. It's not a complete seal, but I mean, before these things with the wind, they were basically staying open or banging. There's the vent on the side, that's the west and we get strong, strong winds. So this has been tested up to 40 miles an hour and it's all fine. Let me know what you think, if you've done it to your cooker hood. I'm happy that it's all done now and all I hear is the wind whistling outside and peace inside. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on another video.